Please stay tuned following this presentation for previews of other Barney Home videos. What are you doing? Playing and waiting for Mom. Oh, where is Mom? She's inside getting the baby ready for our walk. That's good. I like it when the whole family takes a walk together. Me too. Can I push the stroller? Daddy, I want to push the stroller. I think we should all take turns pushing the stroller, don't you? That's all right with me. OK. Well then, are you ready for our walk? Mother, where is mother? Here I am, here I am. How are you today, Mom? Very well, I thank you. Let's all play, let's all play. It's nice when families play and have fun together. Oh, BJ, you're so cranky. <laughs> well, Sissy, you're the noisy one. I'm not. Or two. I'm not. Or two. Noisy, noisy, noisy. Oh. I'm oh. not. Cranky, cranky, cranky. Uh, no way, Sissy. Oh, way, BJ. Way, way. Why? Oh, that doesn't sound like a happy brother and sister. Big baby! You're the big baby. Well, you're a... a... a floopity boot! <laughs> oh, there's no such thing as a floopity boot. Yes, there is. And you're it! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, uh, I'm never talking to you ever again! Oh, uh, good, because I'm not talking to you either. Good! I'm 
going downstairs. Oh! Oh, dear. Aw, oh, nuts. It's no fun when brothers and sisters are mad at each other. You're so right, Scooter. Oh, I do hope they'll make up and be friends again. I do. I'm not a slowpoke, and I'm not a whiner either. I don't care what BJ says. Bye. Oh, oh, oh. oh, Barney! Sometimes my brother makes me so mad! Well, I can see you're really upset, Baby Bop, but sometimes everybody gets mad. It's even true for your mom and dad. So if that feeling gets a hold of you, tell me some things that you might do. Oh, well, there's lots of things I could do. Like, sometimes I run or jump up and down. Or color with black and red, you do? Or am I hold tight to an old stuffed animal? My the teddy named Fred. Mm -hmm. And then what? Then I talk about my feelings with a friend. Or a teacher or my mom. Sometimes, hi, hi, hi. I make a fist or stamp my feet or scream with lots of power. Yeah. Or I sing a song that's fast and loud once I sing for half an hour. Whoa. Then I talk about my feelings with a friend or a teacher or my mom or a So mad at Baby Bop? No, oh, because. BJ, when you're not angry with Baby Bop, what do you like best about her? Well, I guess I like the way she dances <laughs> and her little giggle. But that's only when I'm not mad at her. Baby Bop, are you mad at BJ? Yes. Why? Just cause. Baby Bob? Yes, Barney? Well, I know you're mad at BJ right now, but if you weren't, what would be your favorite thing to do with him? Oh, that's easy. <laughs> I'd go for a walk with him and he pulls me in my little red wagon. <laughs> oh, that sounds like fun. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. talking to you either. Oh, sometimes brothers and sisters fight, but they still love each other. Ashley, do you and your sister ever argue? Sometimes when we don't agree. Uh-huh, we like different things. Like, I want a cat, but Ashley wants a dog. And I like to sleep with the light on, but Alyssa likes the light off. I like loud music, and I like soft music. <laughs> if you don't like the same things, how do you get along? Yeah. We like each other because we're different. Being different is what makes each of you special. BJ, what's different about your sister that you like? Uh, well, I guess I like it that she's little. <laughs> Baby Bob, what do you like about your brother that's different from you? Well, he's 
big. What did you say, big? Yes. Big. Little. Wow. Big. Wow. <laughs> little. We're big and little and short and tall. Some are in the middle, some are very small. We come in all shapes and sizes. Hey, little, little, we're big and little and everything in between. Boom. Wow. <laughs> little. <laughs> big. Wow. We come in all shapes and sizes. Hey, little, little, we're big and little, and everything in between. <laughs> big. Oh. Little. Wow. Big. Wow. Little. Big. Little. Big. Little. Yay. <laughs> big, little, big, little. I'm going back up to the tree house. Good. You go. I'm going to go get my Fine. Oh. Looks like they're still mad at each other. I'm afraid you're right, Robert. Maybe we should go check on Baby Bop. She seems pretty angry. Oh, that's a good idea. I'll go with you, Jeff. <laughs> BJ was pretty upset, too. He sure was. Oh, well, brothers and sisters can be very different, can't they? Yes, even twin sisters can be very different. But that's exactly what makes me, me. And Ashley, Ashley. That's right. If Alyssa and I did everything the same way and liked all the same things, then no one could tell who's who. Oh, but you two are different and very special in your own way. You are special. You're the only one. You're the only one like you. That's right. There is that's another in the whole wide world who can do the things you do. Because you are special. when we argue. Yeah, but it's even harder not to have you for my friend. Well, we'll keep trying to help BJ and Baby Bob be friends again. Okay, let's go. All right. <laughs> Hey there, BJ. What you doing? Oh, looking at books. Oh. Oh, you... oh, I think this is one of Baby Bob's favorite books. Is it the squirrel that could whirl and twirl? <laughs> I'm nuts for that book. <laughs> no. Well, perhaps you're holding the rickety chickadee. Oh, or the pleasant pheasant, <laughs> or the foul owl. <laughs> No, it's the stinky skunk and the elephant's trunk. Oh. I like to read this to... Well, I used to like to read this to Baby Bob. I wish... Well, I wish... I wish... That you had a new bike? No. I wish... I wish that you had a big ice cream cone. No, I wish BJ and I weren't mad at each other. Would you like me to read a book to you? No, thanks. I like it best when BJ reads to me. <laughs> he makes reading books fun. <laughs> I like the radio. I love to watch TV.
every time I take a look Cause books can take me anywhere that I want to go Books help my imagination grow That's right <laughs> Books are fun, books are great Let's sit down with a book today Books are fun, books are great Is it book time yet? Oh, I just can't wait to read a book <laughs> to both of you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> hey, everybody. It's my good friend, Tommy DePaula. Hi, Mr. DePaula. Hi, everybody. Please, call me Tommy. Okay. Oh, Tommy wrote the book BJ and Baby Bob Want to Read. That's right, Barney, and I drew the pictures, too. Oh, oh. would you read your book to us, Mr. DePaula? Sure, BJ. It's a story about me when I was a little boy about your age. Oh, cool. It's called... The Baby Sister. Oh, goody. <laughs> oh, brother. <laughs> What's the matter, BJ? Oh, I'm just having a little trouble with sissy, Tommy. Well, you know, BJ, it can be really nice to have a little sister. Just listen. Oh, I want to get my blanket. All right. Oh, I just lost the yeah. <laughs> Tommy had a mother, a father, two grandmothers, one grandfather, lots of aunts and uncles, an older brother, Buddy, and a dog named Tootsie. <laughs> and lots and lots of cousins. Wow. So when Tommy's mother told him that she was going to have a baby, Tommy said, can I have a baby sister with a red ribbon in her hair? <laughs> we'll see, his mother told him. Can I do something for the baby's room, Tommy asked his mother. I want to paint a picture for the wall. Of course you can, his mother said. And see, here's me when I was a little boy painting pictures for the baby's room. Oh, oh. look. <laughs> well, those are pretty pictures. <laughs> what happened next? <laughs> As the months passed, Tommy's mother's tummy grew bigger and bigger. Wow. The baby's in there, she told Tommy, pointing to her tummy. Tommy leaned his head against her. Hi, baby, he whispered. <laughs> that night, when Tommy and Buddy were asleep, their mother told their dad that it was time to go to the hospital. Don't forget to wake up Tommy when you get home, Joe, and tell him if he has a new baby sister or a baby brother. I won't forget, Floss, I promise, Tommy's father said. As soon as he got home early in the morning, Tommy's dad woke him up. You have a baby sister, Tommy. <laughs> when can I see the baby? When can I see mom? Are they coming home tomorrow? Oh, slow down, Tommy, his dad told him. <laughs> they have to stay at the hospital for a few days at least. On Sunday, his dad went to the hospital to get his mother and his baby sister. Everyone else waited at the house. Nana Fall River and Nana, his Irish grandmother, his grandfather Tom, Uncle Charles and his girlfriend Viva, Aunt Nell, Buddy, and Tootsie. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy heard the car pull into the driveway. The door opened, and there was his mother holding a small bundle in her arms. Tommy hid behind the big armchair as everybody crowded around his mom and the new baby. Uh -huh. Where's Tommy? His mother asked. Here I am, Tommy oh. shouted, jumping up from behind the armchair. Here I am. <laughs> his mother kissed him. Then Nana Fall River said, Firenze, Florence, let Nana have the baby. My friend, Nana Fall River said, turning to Tommy. 
Sit down so you can hold your new sister. Aww. Tommy sat in the big armchair, and Nana placed the warm bundle in his arms and folded back the blanket. Tommy's baby sister, Maureen, with a red ribbon in her hair, looked up at him. And Tommy was the happiest boy in the world. The end. <laughs> Thanks for reading your book to us, Tommy. It was a good story. Oh, it was. <laughs> I like the part where you got to hold your baby sister the day she came home from the hospital. Yeah. <laughs> was your little sister really that special to you? She sure was, BJ. In fact, she's still my best friend in the world. Oh. Oh. Here's a picture of the two of us. <gasps> wow. I was about your age, BJ, and Maureen was about your age, baby Bob. Oh, she's giving you a big hug. <laughs> and I still oh. give him lots of hugs. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, hello there, Maureen. Hey, everybody, this is Tommy's little sister, Maureen. But she's all grown up now. <laughs> <laughs> you see, BJ, Baby Bob, brothers and sisters are more than just members of the same family. They can be friends for life. That's wow. right, Barney. <laughs> it's great to do things with a big brother, like riding bikes, or feeding the birds, or taking walks. In fact, we're going to spend the afternoon in the park together. So, goodbye, everybody. Really great to see you. Bye, Bye. 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 I'm sorry I got mad at you, sissy. I'm glad I have a little sister like you. And I'm glad I have a big brother like you, BJ. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes we're real close friends. We stay up late and talk at night. Other times we don't get along. There are even times we fight. But I know he's always there. And I know he'll always care. He's my brother. I love my brother. <laughs> I've given her a great big hug. <laughs> when she was feeling bad. And then again I said some things that really made her mad. Yeah. But I know she's always there. And I know she'll always care. She's my sister. I love my sister. He's my brother. It's nice to see your brother and sister happy again. Friends, too. <laughs> well, happiness is always more fun when you share it with a friend. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. You love me. We're a happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Won't you say you love me too? anymore, BJ. Uh, me too, sissy. Hey, come on, let's go fly kites. <laughs> but I don't want to fly kites. Hey. I'm teasing. Bye. 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 I guess I'd better be going, Barney. Me too. See you yeah. later. Bye, Barney. See you later. Bye. 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 Have a nice day. Bye. See you Bye. soon. Hey, everybody.
everybody, it's time for Barney Says. Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. Families can have lots of fun together, but sometimes we get angry at our brothers and sisters. If we think about what we like about our brother or sister, we won't stay angry very long. Brothers and sisters can be best friends, even when they're grown up. I'm glad when friends make up and share a hug. And remember, I love you. <laughs> Everyone's favorite dino starring in his very first cosmic adventure, Barney in Outer Space. When Barney and his friends discover a new friend on another planet, they zoom off to meet her, learning about the wonders of the universe all along the way. We're in outer space, all right. Come along as these space cadets explore new worlds and make new friends, including a real live astronaut. Our spaceship has a guest. <laughs> With plenty of great songs and lots of imagination, it's an adventure you won't soon forget. So grab your spacesuits, because this super de duper spaceship is about to blast off. Don't miss Barney in Outer Space, now available on home video from Lyric Studios. It certainly is a great day for counting, so let's go! If you love great stories... I can show you where to look. Big dinosaurs! Whoa! Am I big enough? And a whole lot of numbers... Hey, everyone, I found the number two in Texas! Then get ready, because... It's time for counting! The newest home video from Barney! Come on, let's practice one, two, three! When the numbers on Stella the Storyteller's alarm clock wind up missing... Most of the numbers are missing. It's up to Barney and all his friends to help her find them. Great idea. Let's go. Get ready for lots of wonderful stories. Okay. Once upon a time, in the wall of a farmer's cottage, there Plus fun and music four. galore. And great numbers like 12, 9, and 4. That's a kitschy little rhyme. <laughs> Learning how to count has never been this much fun. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> Don't miss It's Time for Counting, now on home video from Lyric Studios. <laughs> 